I'm Stuart Wyeth, I'm 34 years old and I'm an astrophysicist. Astronomy is a bit like studying history. We would like to know how the Earth's solar system and our galaxy came to be here. This is all the product of the evolution of the universe over the full 13.7 billion years. We have a good picture of what happened in the last half of that time, but we have no real idea of what happened in the first billion years of the formation of galaxies. How long that was after the Big Bang and what those galaxies looked like. What my work involves is trying to understand when those first galaxies turned on, how many galaxies there were, what the stars were like in those galaxies. What we're doing is to look at new radio telescope to try and uh, detect radio waves from the matter in the universe that surrounds those galaxies. My job entails two main parts. I research the early galaxies in the universe, spend a typical day writing a computer program to solve whatever problem I'm interested in at the time. So taking the physical world and translating that into a model which you can solve with a computer. The other part of my job involves teaching, but also training in research for students that are undertaking their honours year and also studying towards a PhD to see that their research projects are going well and, and on track and, and in a good direction. My interest in astronomy goes a long way back. I originally uh, was in astronomy club at school, like many people. I went to university, became an engineer, but I dropped out of university for a couple of years and in the process decided that astronomy was what I really wanted to do. And so when I came back to university, I did physics um, and got involved with the astronomy group at Melbourne University and went on to do further study, postgraduate study. Got a Bachelor of Science with Honours degree um, and that's in physics and then I have a PhD in astrophysics. So my work doesn't really take place in the field at all. I'm very much a theoretical astrophysicist. My work takes place really in, entirely in the city, um, mostly in my office. As a theorist, you need to have an appreciation for uh, what it takes to actually get the observations that really understand uh, what's going on in the universe. And so I do like to go with my colleagues to the telescope to see what's going on. My work involves uh, trying to interpret the observations once that they're made in terms of a, a theoretical model that we produce. Most astronomers, even the ones that use the telescopes regularly, will travel to the telescope for a few weeks a year to collect the data that they need and then all the analysis will take place in their offices in the CBD. Yeah, I think I, I chose a very good career for myself and I can choose problems in astronomy that do only take uh, a few months to solve rather than years and that suits my personality very well. The advice I'd give anyone interested in this career is to give it a go. A research career is, is something that's very rewarding. At the end of study, you're not restricted to going into astronomy. You can go into many other areas, any area that requires quantitative solving of problems, particularly with computers, new areas such as bioinformatics or things like medical imaging. These are, are areas that people can easily transport the skills that they learn as astronomers. I do love my job, the best job I could, could think of having. Freedom of thought, interesting problems, great people. It's all good.